So you see this message? This is what has taken up almost an hour of my morning. Hi everyone, welcome to my day. And that message you saw is actually on my iPad. And basically, I've been talking to Sky, the TV people in the UK. And instead of ringing them, I decided to use their chat system. Now the reason I didn't ring them is because I couldn't find an 0800 number for them this time. It's either an 033 something number, which has a connection fee, plus a per minute fee, and it would have probably cost me about five or six pounds to actually make that call. And then the number for new customers is an 0844 number, and I couldn't find an alternative to that one either. So I thought, let's use the chat system, let's use the new technology that's available to me. Jumped on the chat system, and I do this probably once a year to try and negotiate a better deal with them on my TV package, because I can't afford, or I can't justify, the cost that I pay for television. I don't watch a lot of television. I don't watch any sports. I don't watch any movies, because when I watch a movie, movie, I either go to the cinema, or I sort of download something, or I rent it, or I watch it on Apple TV, or I buy a Blu-ray. So that's the way I watch my movies. And I just wanted to negotiate a better deal again. So I was considering actually switching completely and changing my Sky service to FreeSat so that I didn't have any monthly costs at all. So I jumped on the chat and to cut a long story short, I know I've babbled on about it already, but it took me over an hour to go through that chat to get any sort of sense out of the customer service agent that was trying to help me. And it was as though they have to go through this same pattern of questions. He even asked if he could ask a question, which is a pet hate of mine, because that happens to me on Twitter. I get people tweeting me saying, Dave, can I ask you a question? Well, you've just wasted a question. You've just asked a question. So anyway, he asked me, can I ask a question? I said, please, with all due respect, don't ask if you can ask a question. Ask me what you need to know, because the end goal is I need to either reduce my monthly cost or change to FreeSat. It still took me an hour or just over an hour to sort it out, but I did get a discount. I got roughly about 57% off, I think it was, for the next year. So it was well worth doing, but quite time consuming. Mind you, I was multitasking. I was doing other things while the chat was uh, sort of sitting to the side of me. So anyway, that's my morning so far, apart from doing some editing. Now on with the rest of the day. The weather is absolutely gorgeous today. So I drove down to my favorite spot and have got out of the car for a little walk. And if I go round 360 degrees, I just want to show you something. Over here, the house right in the centre now, I absolutely love the one with the Martello tower behind it. Really nice. And as I was driving past that, I actually sort of looked inside. I couldn't help myself, but it looks absolutely gorgeous inside. seen this area before if you watch my videos regularly I come down here quite often it's just so peaceful I think what I remember about sort of the seaside and just the sound of the sea and the wind is when I was a kid it was really nice memories just sort of I find it really relaxing so I'm just going to continue my walk for about 10 or 15 minutes and I'm actually heading over there because there is some uh, chairs over there so I'm going to sit on like a bench and just taking the surroundings, it really helps me regather my thoughts. And I've got a couple of business ideas that I keep going over and over in my head, and I really find this helpful. It gives me a chance to really refocus. So this is the view from where I'm sitting, and I just wanted to show you, right in the middle of your frame now, right in the distance there, there is a green piece of land. And if you watch my videos regularly, I did actually show you a place that we visit called Samphire Ho. And that's where they put all of the stuff they dug out to make the channel tunnel. That's sort of all of the, uh, just the contents they dug out and they've put it into landfill, put grass on it and they have cattle grazing on it. And you can walk around and see all of the wild flowers they've uh, uh, sort of cultivated there. And it's just a really nice area. There's a little cafe on there as well. So that's called Samphire Ho, and you can actually see that from where I am. And it's probably around about five miles away, I guess, maybe four to five miles. So quite a long distance. Wow, that wind is picking up. It's quite windy up here because it's just so exposed to the elements. So certainly people can hear me, but I've had 
my sit down now for around about sort of 15 minutes or so and had a chance to go through these business ideas and it has really helped. One of my business ideas is product based and I think the reason I'm looking at something that's product based is I think it's got more sustainability and it's something that I want to be able to get my son involved in. And when you're creating content, that's quite personal. Of course I could get him involved in that, but is that something that's got longevity for him? You know, and I want something that he can be sort of proud that he's been a part of building as well. So the actual product idea is coming along quite nicely. The other ideas that I'm going over uh, still need some sort of fleshing out. They're, um, they're works in progress, put it that way. So I've just got back, that was a really good break, and I've just jumped online and done some online shopping because it's my son's birthday in a couple of days' time. But the trip out that I did, and the fresh air and the change of scenery really does help because it just makes you sort of think in a clearer sort of manner without any distractions. So if you do get the opportunity to have a change of scenery, I strongly recommend it. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave me some comments, hit that like button, and I'll see you all again tomorrow. You smoking a cigar? What are you doing? Are you smoking a cigar? Milo. What you got? Oh. Thanks so much for watching the video. If you'd like to watch another amazing video from me, please do click that top box. And if you want to subscribe to my geeky channel, click the red box on the bottom of your screen now. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.